Okay, and this I wanted to show you the eyes are basically following the camera, which is here. So if you, um, any movement that occurs in front of the eyes will be um, controlled by that camera. So if I move left to right, up and down, the eyes follow. This is the woke function. Uh, and the woke only happens on the mosaic, not on the AI. As you see, the AI has taken over and it won't, the eyes do not follow you. Um, this has a touch screen, so you can move this circle around by dragging it. All these areas you can control by touch. This is running at 4K right now, so it's a little sluggish. And essentially you can, um, you can stop and start layers. So for example, if I wanted to stop this, the creation here of the AI, let me, let me, I can, I can move back forward and back. Hold on. So with a finger, you can go touch back and move back and forward in time. And it's showing you what has happened and what will happen in the future, forward and back. And um, also on touch, you can see I stopped the background there with the colors, touch it again turns green and it restarts so one touch when it turns green it's when it's it's on and red is off and um, you touch here you touch and uh, create you basically can compose your images the way you like it and then create a, um, a digital file which is what turns into an NFT. This can be either a still or a moving picture, a video. Let's get these guys going again. All right, there he is. So there is the process by itself, it's autonomous, it's going on by itself and creating random um, non-linear progressions of the original image that you saw earlier. Um, you can um, again touch stop and move back in time forward and backwards.